This is the Aqua Theatre, where I talk to you about whatever and play a game for your visual entertainment. This game is Hexagon, which I discovered from Dowsey. He plays all sorts of stuff. And if you don't know him, there's a link in the description. So, yeah. Yeah, I watched him play this and it was just like, what the, what a stupid game. And then I started to play it, it's like, this is strangely addictive. So, too bad I keep dying. But, yeah. As for me, I'm on uni holidays, which means no classes, but still work to do. I have two exams when I get back and to report you. Also started my volunteer work with Stick Insects last week. James, the guy I'm working for, took me down to the bug room, and man, those bugs were enormous. I was expecting insects that fit in the palm of my hand, but no, the majority of bugs he's got are giant stick insects, which are up to 20 centimeters long. So I managed to clean out their enclosures and give them fresh leaves without throwing out any of these bugs with the old leaves, and without being freaked out. I did let out a small shock noise when a large male flew out of its cage onto my chest, but I wasn't expecting it. That's what I'm claiming anyway. The rest of them just tried to climb the wall to get away from me, so... I also spent about three hours observing whether or not ants collected stick insect eggs or not and took them back to their nest or took them away from their nest. And yeah, that was strangely enjoyable for me. Um, yeah, I'll be going in again this Friday. Might be sorting out eggs from poo this time. <laughs> no, seriously. As well as other things though. But it's good to be doing something practical again. Even if it is with bug poo. So yeah, I mm. haven't really got anything else to say, so enjoy watching me try and beat my high score of, what was it, 20 something seconds, 21 something seconds. And I'll keep trying for about a minute more, then I'll give up. So, more animal facts on your way. So until next time. Game over. The game. Game over. The game.